and then also maybe uh, take on a couple bosses. I fell asleep yesterday. Did you beat that fire enemy? The fire enemy. Fire. Black fire? <laughs> they patched it? Good thing I'm playing offline then, fellas, huh? All you patch Andes. I think you're just mad that the exploit exists. Or trying to fuck with streamers. Both of which are fine. My heart rate is higher today. <laughs> yeah, I'm using a controller. The hell? I beat the lady that threw the books at me, yeah. I beat her within like 10 tries, I want to say. I kind of want to farm for like an hour in the XQC area if I get there so I can up my arcane and up my um, my vigor. I don't want like stupid strength and deck so I destroy everything. But if I could use all the spells I want to rather than being forced to use my Kuchitana only, that'd be pretty tight. And this would cut down the time from like 15 hours to get to that point or one hour. Someone's playing on a 980 Ti. Someone call a patriarch. Heart rate is a roller coaster right now, huh? Just keeps going down and up and down and up. Uh, this is my Kuchitana. Is this Dark Souls but with a skin on? It's made by the people from Dark Souls. So no. Unless you look at every Zelda game and then you go, is this just the original Legend of Zelda with a skin on? In which case, yeah, then it is. Depends how your weird brain works. Okay. It is just reskin Tetris at the end of the day. All games are just rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I don't think I've gone up into this bitch yet. Oh. Let's try that again, I suppose.
Oh no, 310 is super wrong. Chat, what's my death count at? 217. 218 now. Three ten, three oh nine. No, that's what it, it it for whatever reason, when I just leave the game on or the 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 death counter on, it just adds some. It was two eighty four last night, was it? It was definitely not the two nineteen? Yeah. I didn't know what it was. It definitely was not uh three hundred. Kyle's jump in, baby. <sighs> Holy fuck, that's a big bear. <whistles> Definitely not 300, not yet. Oh, good catch. Sneaky, sneaky. Okay. This is a very grand castle. Can't go that way. Bummer. Is that just a tree sentinel? <gasps> Two tree sentinels? I ain't fucking with that. Wait, this looks exactly like the other castle. The one with the ladder? It's the same entryway. But it's different. Maybe they just reskinned it? Ever try blue light? Yeah. I usually do some blue light shit. Golden seed? Golden seed? Two golden seeds? What? Sup, chest moose? And a map? Dude, why can't every area be like this? Oh, this is the great tree of Yadur. Alright, golden seeds mean good stuff. It means we can up our flask count. Which means we have nine flasks. Absurd. Ten total, nine for health. Alright, this area looks kind of abandoned. Let's just run through. Well kept trees. Is that a dragon? Oh, I wonder he's trying to fight. Looks like a Oh no, no way. What?
How is that even a thing? Oh, it's probably the doing because the great tree, the closer you are to the great tree, the more golden trees nearby, the more golden seeds. Do you think the golden tree is mad at me for stealing from the golden tree? I'd be kind of peeved. It looks like every castle has the same exact decor for the entrance. We can't go in the door. What can we do? I guess we could travel by the low side. Nice castle. Alright, we'll go this way. What I really want is to charge up my flasks, not necessarily more flasks. Flasks. I'd like, like, a plus four in an ideal world. Thought I heard someone. I'm on edge. Can I visit the golden tree? Well, do you guys remember when I went to the, the round table of the, um, the forgotten, whatever the fuck our people are called? It told me to go to the gold tree to become a, an Elden King or a ring. I forget which. So I think I got to go there. This feels like an optional boss area if I had to be the judge. Actually, no. Underpass. That brings me back up. What? Wasn't I just here, though? Curious. Hmm. I missed. Lol. I want to go to the great tree. My biggest problem in this game is finding shit. I think it's probably because the restrictions I've given myself to beat it in one stream and I have a until Sunday night. But it's made it a pain in the ass. Finding shit's a bitch. Ladder on the other side of the gate. I'll never believe you ever again. Golden order seal? That seems too good to just find. Hmm. There must be a way into the castle that I'm missing. Yeah, I think the average person's supposed to like casually play through the game 
and be like, oh, what's this? And then discover more and more and more, and the world will unfold itself. But trying to beat it in, like, you know, sub 45 hours, 50 hours, whatever it is. Then I'm just like, where the fuck am I supposed to go? You gonna grind or have you forgotten? I don't know how to get there. I ain't forgotten shit. It's not exactly like the game's like, yo. One XP? Come try out the XQC strat. Holy grease. Cool. There is a ladder, no cap. I don't believe you, and I never will ever again, boys. You have to know. Wait, is this a new area? Oh no, that's the enemy that flew down. What a big guy. For no reason. I hate ladders. I could go straight. I tried going right. I never went straight. But straight seems to lead me towards the area I was at yesterday. So I don't think it's right. Nah, I guess it works. Because you go straight, then right, then loop around. Let's give it a shot. Wait. Isn't that... It's Garfunkel. How are you back? Oh, is this Margaret? In a while. Whoa. What? I'd prefer if you don't do the fade into reality thing. Summon. A really good suggestion. It's not possible in this area. felt great. Why is he back? Is this not Garfunkel? Is it Margit? I guess Margit was electricity. It is a little refresher. You pop out the womb way stronger than I thought.
Oh, your tail. All right, throw your little thingies. Everyone knows it's coming. Damn it. Okay, all right, we got this, baby. What, the triple? The fucking hole in the ground! I, dude, and that's why just we got to change the government. They just don't care about us. What am I paying taxes for? Potholes left and right. God damn. Damn, I was looking at my phone, you fucker. Okay. Forgot how much I hate the lightning. Oh. It, it, you, 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 you need lag time. Do you know that as a boss? Otherwise, you're just unbeatable. God damn it, Margaret. Okay, nice. Halfway. Can't fail that. Jesus. Fucking holes! I'm not playing it. I'm not playing this fight. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna run past them. I'm gonna run past them. I'm not gonna fight in an area where our government clearly has shown a lack of care. It's not my responsibility. I pay my tax dollars. If you're going to have fucking potholes, I'm not going to fight in the area. Simple as that. I'm just going to run right by you. I am no longer interested in the battle. I cannot be fucked, miffed, to sit in this pothole-ridden land. Look at this. Broken carriages everywhere. Whose responsibility is that? You know, sometimes I lose five, ten thousand runes after I die. Where do you think that goes? The government? What are they doing with it? Disgusting. Look at this. Look at this. And then they make people live in this filth. Shame on you. Shame on you with all that wealth. Disgusting. I'm out.
Alright, this seems to be the right way to new lands. Hey, guys. What the? Oh, it's one of... Oh, there's two of these? Oh, baby. How accurate are you? Oh, very, very. God damn. I would love a giant to just protect me. What? No, I don't want to. He's optional, right? He's definitely optional. I don't think I need to go into this gate. There's no way. Yeah, it's optional. Peace. <laughs> no shot. I'm good. I don't want the smoke. Uh-uh. Not me. No way. Thought about it. Big pass for me. Big pass. You won't do it? Yeah. You're damn right. You got me. Shit. Boo me again. You got to do it to go through the gate. Yeah, and the gate is not necessary for the storyline. <laughs> Which means I'm out, fellas. That guy does all my health in one lightning strike. And my potions take two to get back to full. It doesn't make sense. I'm not fighting him. I got a goal to do. to beat this game. Optional bosses, not part of my agenda. What is part of my agenda, however, is grinding for mats. to find out how to get to that area XQC was at. That he grinded at for like fucking one hour. Chad, when I say no shot, I mean in the most respectful and honest way possible. I'm not deceiving you. Literally zero chance I fight this guy. I don't even want to lose my 8,000 souls and fight him once. I'd rather just not fight him at all. Call it a day. I'm really trying to figure out how to get to the next section. But 
that's necessary for the storyline. Sorry, one second. I'm silently perusing to figure out how in the hell I get to the next area. I think I have to go. To this red area, yeah. I think I vastly underexplored this red area. I wonder if I can just go underground. I went to the underground city, yeah. No, this was... Yeah, because then I do all this, and then I end up here. For whatever reason, the area that I spawn at doesn't seem viable. Have you gotten the pieces for the Great Lift? The last thing I remember is if I go that way... If I go that way, then it's all three of the giants. I don't think I've really gone this way much. Did Smash get dropped from Evo? Do I live this? Damn, good scream. Oh no, this leads me down here. feel like you're in over your head? Uh, maybe. I'm just fucking lost always. Because <laughs> I, I want to go to this giant area, but I don't know how. But maybe it, it definitely is not running this way. Through the Germa Cave? I think the Germa... I've been to the Germa Cave. I don't think it exits the other side. I also... This doesn't feel right either. I'm just going to keep going down this path. Maybe over here. It's the Celia Cave. I think I did the entirety of the Celia Cave that I have access to, but I think there's a different portion of the Celia Cave that you can reach 
that gets you where you need to go. But I think I have to go down this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think it's literally this road. No ladders. He says stop by the shack. I saw Oh, I thought you were a statue, bro. What? Church atop a cliff, she's sick. Cool. Sounds easy enough. Is this a church? Yes. Is it atop a cliff? Probably not, Ludwig. Celia, town of sorcery. Oh, talk again. Oh, maybe I need like a potion. That's a good point. What the fuck would I do if I go into a sick person? For this, seek the deep scarlet swamp of Aeria outside Cell. The needle made from unalloyed gold. First, you must find it's hidden somewhere. In then I will tell the secret. Dude, no shot. You don't even have the cure. I'm doing everything. Find the needle and find the girl and cure her? Like, what are you doing? Is the secret just that there's a town below it? I feel like that's the secret. Oh! Secret tunnel. Okay. I don't love this town so far. Okay. Dead end? Ugh. Hey, guys. Sorry about it. You're here, too? We gotta get out of here. Oh, big staircase. That's always good. Oh, yes. This sigil is blocking everything. Is that part of the secret of the town that I need to unlock to go further? Or is it an optional thing and I just go another direction? <gasps> it's probably required. What I've learned from this game is it's probably not required. Most things in this game are not required. But they seem like they are required. So it's so easy to just get lost walking around in a good way, I think. Like if I was playing this for fun casually, then I'd be like, oh, wow, yeah, I'll do that. Cool. Rather than side, like, like, let's be real. That's a fucking shitty ass side quest that you get in Elder Scrolls that it says, fetch the scroll from, from Rigormorth and then bring it over to Circumcision Town. And I will pay you 4010. Depends. That's it. That's the whole fucking thing. It's not main quest. It's not even close. Wait, I've been here, haven't I? Let's find out. You like? You like? Are these smithing stone threes? They have to be. Smithing stone fives? Wait. So the whole time I was supposed to go here.
it's the chest trap area. Was I supposed to go here the whole time? It's Germa Cave. I love calling it Germa Cave. How'd you hit me? Did I damage someone by falling on them? It's kind of hurtful. I've been here. How do I get to the next area? I don't think this area has an out. Oh. You pieces of... A wall you didn't smash? I believe the wall I didn't smash leads me back to the poison swamp, which leads me in a circle back to where I am here. It brings me down here. Because you go up here. Go to the third church. All right. Oh, wait, though. Staircase. This has to be good. Oh, it just leads me back to the village. Confusing, confusing area. Alright, well, we can come back anytime. All I want to do, really, is get to this. That's my dream. And it seems like it'd be so close to this, but it's not. So let's just go to the third church. Everyone's freaking out about the third church. I don't even know where the first search is. Where did you... F Maybe the quest isn't optional. I think the general gamer rule of thumb is if a quest ever involves you doing a simple task as if you are, like, getting an item to heal someone, it, basically a fetch quest, usually it's optional. Chat quests are usually not optional. Like, talk to Midgard to learn about... Usually those things aren't as optional. Depends. Could ask S X in French? I could. Uh, 
All right, where are where are our third church? Maybe I should go down this area. Is there a quest log in this game? It's a good question. I don't think so. None. Yeah, let me change a pin with chat message. This is a jet forest. Have I never been in this area? Why does it all always lead back? To this. Wait, way north of that? Giants, baby. We've moved on from Giants. I guess I do remember going down this sheer cliff face. And then I went into the first room I saw. Which I think led me to an optional area in Sofree as well. And then I just... I, writ, I wrote this entire section off. Because I was like, oh, I did the thing. But I think the thing I did was incredibly optional. And that's why I have that cool summon. I remember I was running through this. I was like, holy fuck, bear, scary, bear, scary. And I went into the first room I saw. And it was a giant elevator into a magical world. And I spent about five hours in the magical world yesterday. This is exactly what happened. That's the bear. What? You suck me with your... Throat? <laughs> Look. I'm just calling it like I see it, fellas. Okay. Giant. Oh, I love that. Oh, Third Church of Marika. What is this? Flask of Wondrous Physic. Psychic. You can find crystal tears at the base of minor earth trees and elsewhere throughout the lands. Oh, I have one. At the site of grace, you can mix two crystals. It'll allow you to create elixirs. Oh, sick. Oh, a sacred tear. I feel like it's so late to be discovering another, uh, like, craft. With this menu, you can mix two crystals in the Flask of Wondrous Psychic. Uh, physic. Physic? This will allow you to create physics with various custom effects. Okay, that's bad. This is just Riku from Final Fantasy X. Restore half of total FP in mixed... And then this one 
is restore half of total HP. And then together they do... How do I... How do I go, go gadget? Is it just done? I thought it'd be like bigger than the sum of its parts. I was like half HP, half MP. This probably is like a full HP, full MP. But it's, it, no, it's just, it's just that again. You only get one charge. So it's just another potion. India forever. Hey man, um, hell yeah. All right, flasks, we can upgrade. And then also get one more. Which means, gentlemen, we're at 10 flasks plus three. Oh, the physics restore every time you rest? Wait, so it's just another flask. Can I go in water yet? Timer where? No timer, but we've been going 46 hours. Haven't caught any spoilers from the stream because all you do is errands. You're not wrong. Also, it's so hard. If you watch an hour of anybody play this game, it's so hard to get spoiled because the main story is like, I want to say like an hour of content. <laughs> this is like a hundred hour content game. The main story, like all the cutscenes is like an hour and it's fucking impossible to find those cutscenes. It'd be absurd unless they're at the very end, in which case, yeah, definitely. Um, why did I go to the third church of Marika? I'm starting to realize, gentlemen, I might be the problem. No. No, it's the game. It's the only thing that makes sense. When in doubt, take the main road. Bit of a yeet situation. Kind of overkill. We could have just walked around. <laughs> You're so unfocused. Me? Ooh, cave. Gale Tunnel. Alright, I'll check it out. Just while I'm here. Alright, I won't check it out. Smithing Stone 3? Dude. Ugh, too many Smithing Stone 4s. Wait, I can't teleport out? What the heck? Sacred tears are in churches. No wonder I don't find them. Only one god I worship. Can I get an amen, brothers? There's a portal behind the church. I'm under the impression you guys were capping. Secure the perimeter. Ban all liars. Don't actually.
In the water on the right? <laughs> oh, here? In, oh, in this water? Oh, is that right? What do, do I just jump in? Wait. No, guys, I've done this. If you're talking about this, I've literally done this entire section. That wasn't a river. It was a waterfall. Dude, what are you, geometrists? I want to be very clear. This is not a river. This is a river. And that's where I went. What you guys are talking about is a lake. A river is a body of water that flows into the greater ocean. Oftentimes fresh water because... Of the way that it interacts with the sediment around it. You just pass it? No, I'm just getting the high ground. That was me paying my taxes. All right, here's the river. This? That's main storyline? No way, dude. How the fuck am I supposed to find that? It's shrouded in leaves. Who in the fuck? I'm assuming we're good. Cover my back while I'm in here. Souls? I said I'm paying my taxes. When we get to our farming spot, we won't need souls. Sub, dude. You look like the cookie monster, but like in a dystopian world where there's no cookies. Okay. Is this like a kill you situation or... Like this... Oh. You tanked that a little too well. Where are we on the map? Mm -hmm. Are we friends, maybe? Alright, cool. I don't love killing helpless characters. I happen to kill a few helpless characters from time to time. Yes. Is it malicious? No. I'm a golden seed connoisseur. I'm gonna have like 18 flasks by the end of this. Flasks. I like words that end in Tree. Hmm. Interesting. I get what you guys mean when you say I get sidetracked. Oh, map. No wonder I miss maps. I always go to, like, the edge. 
That's not a map. Follow the main road. Oh, bridge. If there's a place you want to go, I'm the one you need to know. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Ooh. Don't mind if I glue. Ooh. Oh, that's a nice Erd tree. There's probably some good shit near it. Excuse me, coming through. Just trying to find my Erd tree. Ooh, megged. Get absolutely fucking diced, bro. You look stupid. Right between your legs. Does it smell like popping game or is it just me? Terrible. Oh, some Fergal Blooms. I was just saying we needed more Fergal Bloom. Oh. I'll fight you. Don't hit me, I'm summoning. Fair. Skipping dragons? This guy's worth fighting because he will up my flask count. Although he one shot me, so I'm really not going to give this guy many tries. Unless I do a shit ton of damage. Yeah, we're not going to fight him. Dragon Samurai skipping dragons. The reason I skip dragons is because dragon fights are incredibly shit. They are like, like you'll be fighting a dragon. It's an epic scene. And then the dragon just sometimes disappears. It's happened to me multiple times. It's happened to Toast. And they're the, they're the glitchiest thing in the game. Sometimes dragons just fucking fly away. And, uh, and just, they'll be on a mountain breathing fire and other shit. And then... They, they have the same combat. They're all reskinned. With occasionally, like, oh, this guy has lightning. This guy has fire. I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little disappointed about dragon fights. It's the only fight that I've been in where it, like, pulls me out of the immersion in the game. Not to be a hater hater. But like you die 15 times on a on a dragon then it fucking disappears. It feels pretty bad. Skyrim had the same problem. Dude. I'm I'm feeling a little under leveled for this area. Eight eighty seven for that guy. Poison. What the fuck am I doing in here? Okay, I'm already poisoned, so you don't have to like rub it in. Yeah, no, we get it. Has he grinded? Genuinely just trying to find the spot. Is that a dragon wing? Holy shit, that's badass. What is that symbol? Oh, that's all my stuff. Oh, I might as well heal up. Uh, 
You need the metal in that fort? All right, bet. I got you, Jay. Jay says I need something. I go in. For Jay! Fuck you, bats! Ooh, deck dismetal right. Kind of a bummer both parts aren't in there. This castle's a lot bigger than I thought. That's all we needed, right, Jay? Kind of a mission, mission accomplished. The best part about this game, I will say, is the fact that you can collect items, die, and keep all your items that you collected. Because it allows you to just run in haphazardly. Like a like a bona fide idiot, lose some runes, but get a bunch of cool shit. There must be some other dope shit. Are these guards visions or are they chasing me? Getting the feeling that they're chasing me. Ooh, can't follow me here, can ya? Wow, that's a big rat. I wanted this. Ragdon's surreal. Am I stuck in here? Oh, I don't want to be stuck in here with you. No offense. I got the heebie jeebies. A little bit of the icky wickies. Alright, well, I got the surreal thing and the medallion. So we're all done here. But I want to go... Ooh, follow the main road and I can go here. Nice. All right, so I have to fall... I have to go to point mark five. Wow. Is this dragon alive? Wait, I thought this dragon was dead. Wait, are these a bunch of dragons? Dude. Ooh, surely we're not going to fight. What the fuck? What do you mean? You're all alive? How do you function? What do you eat if you're that big? It doesn't make any sense economically. The dragon empire would fall. It would crumble. You'd have to eat your own offspring. More dragon? Yo, is that Candace over there? Made you look... As the Dragon Samurai, I will return. But fucking not right now. Why am I pulsing red? Is that a good pulsing red thing or a bad pulsing red thing? Nice, dude. I love finding a new area. This seems promising. Let's follow the main road, though. What I've learned about the game is I'm a fucking idiot. And the main road is main storyline. Not main road, not main storyline. Keep it simple, stupid. They even have railings. They have bumpers, and I'm still getting lost. I'm like a dumb bowling ball. Wow. Not gonna lie, kind of prefer the dragons. You look like dog T-Rexes. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's what you're modeled after. I read this Reddit um, thread, and it was like, Elden Ring is, um, whoa. Well, that's pretty. It was like, Elden Ring is too, e it's really easy going through all the mobs, but the bosses are harder. And there's like a thread, it was like, the Nameless King is every boss, because they stagger so much. And I just don't think they've gone far enough. 
Because I thought that for a bit. I was like, oh, man, all these bosses are easy. Or all these mobs are easy, excuse me. I can just run through them all. But, but, f these guys? Kind of fucked. Oh, my computer crashed. Shit. Shit. Shit, boys. Bad news. Oh, this is bad news. There's this bug that crashes my chrome for a few minutes, and it makes my game glitch out. Okay, we're still alive. Oof, nerve-wracking. I love touching grass, dude. I'll say it. Well, it's been an age. Okay. You must have some good shit, right? Dragon. That's literally my armor. You don't sell anything better than literally mine? Come on, bro. Ooh, Ashes of War. Alright, chat's back. Hey, guys. You shoot that hot! Oh, I got my Ashes of War. Damn, you just pointing to the moon? Wait, what happens if you miss the wall? Oh, uh, I kind of wanted to see it, like, go all the way up. No fall damage for- go for it. It- the fall damage works weird. I will admit that. Huh. Okay, so I was down in this area earlier. I'm still in a fight with a giant. I need to go to this great chasm. And past the giants. I lost my rune somewhere, yeah. Oh, fuck you. Oh, this one has shiny eyes. He's probably worth like 10k. I bet that guy gives you 10k runes. The thing is, he one-shots me. He's literally harder than any boss I faced. Main road. The main road ended. I think I should go up to this thing. Go to the XQC place. I'll keep it a stack, and this is embarrassing. I've been trying. I know it doesn't look like it because I'm a lost boopy. But I've genuinely been trying. It's in Norcon. Oh, Norcon. Okay, my bad. Why did I think this was a good idea? I'm gonna hop off, take this ladder. Don't mind me, good sir. I have not seen the Evo news. Down there's a level eight smithing stone. That's Pog. I don't even have a six or a seven. This seems like the end area. No ultimate? What about melee?
Wow. Dude, I wonder if I'll get sued by Nintendo for running a tournament. The only part of it that's illegal is streaming it, right? All right, well, I guess I really do have to run the biggest smash in all time. My heart rate went up. Yeah. If you think that's bad, check Aiden's heart rate right now. <laughs> that boy just went to cardiac arrest. What do you mean, Ludwig? A thousand for that guy? Man, XP really ramps up at the end. This is the only level I've been in in the entire map where the enemies are considerably harder, but finally give a reasonable, a reasonably higher amount of XP. And I'm going to imagine right now, I'm just going to imagine that when I get to the point where I get to this area, the XP is still going to be uh, be pretty negligible because it's going to be like 50k a level. Is this the end of the game or something? It feels like some end of the game shit. What the fuck was the point of this? I feel like I'm scaling Ganon's castle. How do I... Did I just soft lock? Do I live this? Leroy Jenkins! Yeah, I play a bit of Jump King. The old twofer, the old... Bet. Bet, bet, bet. Good shit, good shit, good shit. Okay, so this is the end of the game. I've discovered it. I feel really good about discovering it. We can move the fuck on. I don't need to do this area yet. Should I go to the Celia Gateway? No, that's Celia Town. And Games North? You're telling me that's some other shit then? Insane. Go to the bottom? Castle Morn? Castle Morn has an optional boss, right? A oh, bottom of Kalid. This area?
Andrew, what Reddit? My Reddit? Wait, I remember you. I'm not even over there. Is Lud even close? I'll keep it a stack. The XQC strat is our only hope. I can get Angel's Flame, spew Flame Breath of Agil. Oh, no, Agil. Well, I already have Fire Breathing, so no. Glinstone Breath is more Fire Breathing. Rot Breath, Icy Breath. None of these really... Like, Fire Breath is Fire Breath is Fire Breath is Fire Breath. I think Dragon Claw should be my next. The game gives off adult Breath of the Wild vibes. I think it's a good way to put it. I'm going to go Dragon Claw. I don't really feel like doing multiple different breaths is the strat. And I feel like if I'm a samurai, Dragon Samurai, I go with the conventional... Fire breath. The, the conventional dragon fire breath. Keep it simple. Are you... Who are you? Oh. Strong. Oh, dude, you're me from the future. Alright. Well, I still have to do a little bit of training, you see. Like, I don't really have, like, a sensei, so it's taking me a little longer to get where you're at. But, like, I respect you for getting there. Honestly, big daps. There's usually an item on these rocks. Golden rune level one. It's kind of pathetic, though. Dude, what are these monsters? These guys again? Ah. Don't mind if I do. Golden seed. Pog champ. Why is the ground shaking? Oh. Dude, you look like a weird-ass vulture. Got a stubby head. Oh, pretty strong legs. Anyone else noticing this giant skull in the ground? That has fungi? Gotta wonder what that was, right? At least I'm not fighting that, you know what I mean? Count your blessings. Wait, I'm being stupid, aren't I? Is this not the same gate? To Celia, yeah it is. I'm in a circle, I'm looping. All right, I have discovered the location via a sleuthing Reddit agent. And by discovered, I'm using that term very loosely. 
because I believe it's in this area. I can't tell. This map looks different than mine. Oh, because it's under. He went underground. He went underground here. And when I say let's play, I'm using that term loosely. But actually. The problem is, I feel like I've already done this area. I feel like I need another. Is there another entrance to the Sofria underground? Or is this it? What are you guys mining? He's fishing. There must be another entrance that I just haphazardly missed. But I vaguely remember going through specifically this door, did I not? I have to go this way somehow. The the place that XQC had to get to his spot is right here-ish. I do not have access to this area. I'm assuming the Gale Tunnel has something to do with it. I, don't, I can't do it yet. I think from my understanding... You have to beat a boss first. So here's, here's exactly how you do it. You have to go to Nokron, the Eternal City. To gain access to Nokron, you have to go to Mistwood. Mistwood is the area here that I've been to before, that I got to um, Sofria before, or Siofra, whatever it's called. Shofra. Uh, but a falling star creates an entryway to Nokron, which is where you need to go to go to the, the specific area of Shofra. But I need, a, I need to activate the Falling Star, and I need to activate the storyline to do that. I don't know how to activate a Falling Star, but I have to beat some boss, I guess. Maybe I have to kill Radon.
How do I get to Radon, though? Is it this area? Why do I struggle so hard to get to that area? On the road again, me and my dogs. Oh, I know why I get off the main road every time. I keep running into this fucking dragon and freaking out. Wait, this is going to loop me back again. Trust the road. Are you still on my tail? I have to bear right. There we go. Wow. Oh, there it is. Feeling how you say a bit nervous about my level in this area. So we're going to beat our... Th the, uh, the plan is beat the third boss to gain access to the XP grinding area. To gain access to new spells, to gain access to be able to beat the next three bosses. Ooh, teleporter. Oh. Convenient. This is exactly where I needed to go. Just about to start. Any ideas what class to use? Uh, I would go with, like, Hero Warrior, if you've never played. They're burning people alive and singing hymns. Is it me or YouTube stream quality suck? It's probably just a lowered quality and you just need to up it. In general, YouTube streams have a higher threshold of quality. They're not necessarily higher quality, but Twitch caps bit rate, bit rate at, I think, 6,500. And YouTube doesn't cap bit rate? I don't know. I'm not a geologist. Always smithing stone fours. I need smithing stone threes so bad. Wait, another teleporter? Ooh. Obviously. Ten eighty P looks bad. I don't know. Maybe it's just because I've been live for 48 hours. Wait. If my webcam's blurry, it's because my autofocus. That's bit ready. I'm 
was a myth, but it looks like he must have heard by now. Right. That Starsker Dredan holds Rani's fate in stasis. But once he's out of the way, it'll spring back into motion. So now, we stand against the demigod once known as the strongest of them all. The way ahead is pleasingly simple. We fight, sword and fang. Together? Into the fray together, eh? <laughs> Let's see what you're made of. Let's go. <laughs> Into the fray. Well, come on, let's go. Dude, the chrome crashing glitch is so fucking annoying. I don't get why it happens. Chrome, fuck you. Look, I just think keeping your computer on and streaming and running Elden Ring for 48 hours just does something. Praetosh, you posted this a lot. I think we figured it out, but I appreciate it. <clears throat> Go Opera. I might. I might switch to becoming an Opera GX user. I never thought I'd see the day. I always thought they were kind of cringe. But maybe they're just actually woke. And I never knew. Okay, let's go fight Radon. I know Radon is possible to beat for the level I'm at. I don't know if I have the skill necessarily. I only know it's possible because Saldosh, famed French streamer and Pog Champs winner, beat Radon without taking a single hit yesterday. And he wasn't like that strong. And he didn't use any incantations or summons or anything. If you find a proper skip, fighting him will be redundant. Are you going to many streams throwing that one around? Or am I the first one you tried that one out on? <laughs> I just gotta know. What the fuck? Is this a different teleporter? Or the same one? It's the same one, right? Probably just run past it. Just thought of it for you. What stream would that kill in? What stream do you drop that line and you're just slaying? Nothing but lol W's. Item! These guys are hard to beat. I know, because I beat one of them. Can't open. Feels good, man. Everything's all close. Smithing stone four. Always. As he fought Radon, I'm in the process of trying to fight him. Unfortunately, I'm just a bit lost, to be honest.
Get the second Kuchitana. People do want me to dual wield, but I really want the dragon scale katana. Alright, let's fight, dude. I'll fight you, puppy dog. Oh. Okay, never mind. Where'd you go? I can't upgrade my sword. I need smithing stone threes, and I only am getting fours. Um. What? I think I'm just dumb. I think this is why I play Jump King. Because even if I'm dumb, all I have to do is jump left or right. Dude, if I run into one more closed door in this damn castle, what is up with this? Fuck are you? What? That guy? Before we begin, allow me to paint you. There's the, the full main picture. character, Wolfman, and I talk to him. Nothing. That guy. Ooh, cutscenes. Pog. General Radan. Is cursed ever to wander. Eaten from the inside by Melania's scarlet rot, his wits are long gone. Now he gathers the corpses of former friends and foes alike, gorging on them like a dog. He's more machine than man. He looks like Ganon. Howling at the sky. But now, we must make merry. <laughs> Why did we just base boost that? Champions, the revels begin. The celebration of war. The Radon Festival. Yeah! Oh my god. Okay. Uh. No, for sure I got you. Yeah. Okay. You will find the field of battle past the church ahead, upon the shore under the fort. General Radan is there, even now, divested of his wits, devouring corpses, and howling at the sky. Cool. So the whole party is me, one dog guy, old dude up there. And then three ghosts? Couldn't have gotten anyone else? Nobody else wanted to come. Alright. And a pot. Hey, thanks for showing up. <laughs> it talks! Radon. Yeah, I know. And General Radan himself. To think I could face a great champion of the shattering, the demigod in the flesh. Oh god. In truth. I don't really like listening to a pot that quivers. Dude, this is the fucking rinkiest, dinkiest group to go after the biggest demigod. Oh, it's an up thing now. Alright, what do you gotta say? 
Seek Wolf. Into the fray together, Dave. Still that line. Did George R. R. Martin write these lines? Literally, yeah. I don't know if that was a joke. George wrote the lines. Miyazaki closed all the fucking doors. Smithing Zone 6, kind of pog. Alright, into the fray. Oh, I gotta pee. Does McDonald's pay you? No. And in fact, no more free marketing for them. Yo. Big oil? No, no, this is a porn site. XX on. They're just a proud sponsor of the stream. Items. Oh. Where's the giant pot? Jesus Christ! Wow! I think my vigor is a bit low. Wow, so you're telling me Saldosh beat this guy by himself without any incarnations and he's French? How the fuck are people dying here? Give me the beat, boss. Free my soul. The accuracy is absurd. Sova ulting from a mile away. How does he even know I'm there? I 
I find it unrealistic, personally. He's a demigod, he knows. So he's half human. Hmm, <laughs> interesting. Okay, three guys summoned. Pog. That was supposed to hit the sword! Okay, now it hits the sword. Oh, the pot's here. Boys, don't even worry about it. Fuck! Jesus Christ. He seems really focused on the one tarnished guy from the group. So many other guys, and he's focused on fighting me. Let's go, friends! Yeehaw! I can't summon my guy? What is this, dude? You guys got it. Straight up. Straight up, you guys got it. He died? What is happening? Dude, I'm just saying, if I could summon my warrior, this wouldn't happen. I would have slashed that down. Right now! Horseback, not really effective. <laughs> God damn. Even the process of summoning is such a pain in the ass, dude. It's such a pain in the ass. How are you not rolling? Because I... Because... Because... The game is bad! Here's what's happening, dude. I have to roll, but also know if it's coming. So I was like, oh, I'll lock on, and that way I'll be able to see. But you can't lock on and run away. So I have to constantly change the camera angle. And then the camera angle changes to where I'm looking. Look, so now I'm just guessing. Right like the wind, baby. Oh, baby, he's fast. That is he on a horse? What? How the fuck is that horse doing this? That horse gotta be on its last legs. Dead ass? How the fuck did Saldo shoot this no hit? How do he dodge that? Wait, someone said I can resummon these guys. How? I want them back.
How do I get my guys back? Where are- where is everyone? Do I have to go all the way back? Oh, why is this horse faster than mine? Dude, what? Can we do it? Can we just cut out the horses? I'll go no horse if you go no horse. Can we gentlemen? Because his horse is way fucking better than mine. And I didn't think I'd be saying that because I thought my horse was pretty good. He could jump twice. That's not how physics work. But all of a sudden, I'm starting to think that fucking my horse blows compared to this guy's horse. Can't believe that missed. I mean, my dodge roll. It did hit. Get off your horse, bitch. Why is he on his horse? There's more summon tablets. Dude. Let's bring a fucking army into this bitch, huh? What do I, what do I need? Give me SEAL Team 6. Straight up. <laughs> Give me some fighters. So all the white flags represent fighters. And the swords beneath them if he breaks them with his arrow. Did we not summon you? Isn't there a summon here? Get in there, baby. Get involved, kings and queens! Today we defeat Radon! The most fearsome of the demigods! Where the fuck are the summons? You, you mother... There, I thought that was I thought that was a message from a player. Keep it going, fellas! The fight doesn't stop! I'm right there with you in spirit! This is all of us together!
putting our lives on the line. Keep it going, boys! Don't quit! He needs to be vanquished! Where the fuck are more summons? No, that's my shitty ass. This is literally seven runes. It's zero. Great. Get in there, Lionel! Okina died? Don't worry. I'll bring you back, sweet prince. God damn it, that's a player. I have a bunch of his spears. How do I use them? Okay, a lot of people are dying. Where are the summons? There we go. There we go. Great Horn Torgoth. I always thought you... I, hey, I always thought you specifically were really cool. Yo, Okina! Welcome back! Hey, here's your chance to do better. Chin up, King. Yeah, last time you had a bit of a spill, bit of a fall, bit of a fuck up. Just bring it back, bring it better. Oh baby, oh baby, guys, you gotta get involved, he's here. He's here, do your thing, gentlemen, do your thing, I'll do my thing. You've almost got him down a quarter health, boys. Keep it up. This is about to be the world's second hitless run of Radon. What happened to my pot? Okay. I thought I'd... I thought it. Okay. I thought I'd hop in for morale. Uh, I kind of, I, I did that. I was there. You guys saw me. I was there. Wait, everyone's dying. Where the fuck are the summons? Where the fuck are the summons? Where the fuck are the summons? Where are the summons, boys? Don't tell me everyone died. Where are the summons? Chat, where are the summons? Where are the summons? Oh. Come on. Give me some gold. Do they spawn at different locations every time? Or is it's the same one, right? <gasps> yes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. Get involved, fellas. Woo! Who's this? Who's this? Oh, you were always my favorite. Um, uh, oh, a samurai. Hey, fellow samurai. Never back down from battle. Samurais always face head on. Any challenge they're given. Don't be cowards now. Come on. This is our only shot. You don't know the resources it takes to keep this horse running. A lot of stamina. She's a runner, she's a track star. Okay, Targoth, I'm not gonna lie. You leave something to be desired. Why me? Why me?
Okay, what do these so-called spears do? Can I throw them like he does? What I wouldn't give to just... It's not a weapon? Mm -hmm. They're arrows? Say less. I'll use my longbow. The most powerful bow of all, they say. The long one. Wait. I'm getting a feeling I can't use the spears. How did that one one shot? But the I find a great bow if I was in the market for a great bow is that like a corner store thing Patches does not sell them. Where the f do you find a great bow? Okay, I just I, I I need I need to see this with my own eyes. How is this possible? He killed him without getting hit.
Okay, here's what I'm thinking. <clears throat> I'm inspired by Saldosh, who beat Radon without getting hit once. I have an idea. If Saldosh was able to do a no-hit run without any incarnations, any bullshit, just straight up man-to-man -man fighting, then I think I am capable of beating, and this might sound bold, in a similar fashion. It's all about learning. It's all about absorbing. Now, I didn't say I'm not going to summon these guys. <laughs> like, like, I'll just summon them. I'll just, I'll just, to see what's up. It's actually, I'm, what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to learn the movement Of Radon, and I'll learn that by having my warriors fight him. But no horse. We're all boots on ground gameplay. Yeah, bitch. How you like? Okay, fuck, I missed. How you like that, bitch? Easy. Easy damage. <laughs> Fuck. Right? Slash. Dead ass lifted his foot. He dead ass. Like I thought I was giving him the beans, and then he just he was like he was like, oh shit, what's that? And then lifted his left foot ever so slightly and it killed me. I think my vigor is a bit too low. If I could survive two shots safely, I would feel very comfortable in this boss fight. But let's be honest, I brought him down to the same amount of HP as running around on a horse for 30 minutes. So I think being in the fray is the strat. Okay, that was fucking annoying. I was trying to summon the guy.
just puts his hands on the ground. If you want to get a great bow, you have to destroy the underground chariot in the stranded graveyard. Look, the only reason I'm killing this guy is so I can fucking do the XQC grind strat. I'll lead us into battle, men. Dude, the wind-up for years, for years, riding around a fucking carousel of a horse, holding his double blades up, fucking XQC headass, for years before he releases it. I'm rolling 15 times in a fucking row, because I'm going against Red Dawn, who's lost his goddamn mind. Fucking eight summons who don't, got no damn clue what they're doing. No damn clue. We had a, we had a festival. No wonder it's called Festival of Radon, because we're celebrating his fucking victory. These goddamn throwing head asses. Paper 2. Literally trash. F you should have been there for Margit. That would have been a sweat for you fucks. Taking on Radon, you're shit! Why is it following me? That's not how it fucking... He shot it in the air and it tracks me? I saw it leave the bow. It makes no damn sense. Welcome to a Dark Souls-like game. Fusion, who do you think you are? Miyazaki? I've played Dark Souls, you dumbass. You beat one Dark Souls game and all of a sudden, every single Dark Souls boss, you're like, yep. Yeah, <laughs> I guess it is tough. I've beat Dark Souls 3 in 2016, so I kind of get what you're talking about. We're the same, but I'm probably better. Why is it still following me? You didn't shoot that many.
When I'm done with this guy, when? I'm going to do the XQC grind for seven hours. I want to one-shot every boss with a single swipe. From now until midnight. However long it takes me to beat this boss, then from then to midnight, I'm just grinding the XQC strat. I will be getting 15 million souls. I'll be level 800. spawn a football field length away with the guy with the perfect arrow that I can't ride my horse to because I guy I die from a purple fucking beam. Why? Why do I gotta go through an 80 second cutscene just to get to the goddamn boss? Can he not just be like fuck can he not just be turned around? Can we do could an element of surprise perhaps? Fucking arrows! Don't stop! What the fuck? Oh my god! How many did you shoot up there? Jesus! 300! Let me just fight you! It's so annoying! I just wanna fight you! That's it! I just wanna fight you! I just want I just want to I just want to I just want to man on man fight fucking arrowhead ass bitch made Is it one shot? How am I getting one shot? I feel like if I'm in the fucking midst, I can learn his attack patterns and beat him. The problem is I just can't get to him. This is the equivalent of binging a Netflix show, but you are forced to, without option, to watch the intro for the show every time. I don't mean to sound dramatic, I would neck myself. I do that, then I found the boss for you, buddy. Europe, you made the joke twice. 
I didn't read it because I thought it was so unoriginal and so unfunny the first time. And then you typed it again. You're too confident in your jokes. Take a day off, Europe. To everyone else who's doing messages that are talking shit, I won't read them. Your message will be forgotten to time. Think of yourself right now and where you are in the universe. It's Saturday afternoon or evening, and you're watching my bitch-ass play and typing in a chat trying to bait me to respond to your message. That's what you're doing with your life. Congratulations, bitch. Plus, your name won't be read or remembered in this instance. Good luck. I read Yerp's name and Yerp's name only. Everybody else's name? Forgotten. Melted into the pot of, of nothingness. Like all of the summoners. Just nothing. Useless. Trash. Get me in there! Step is brutal. I know his four piece easy. You should let the summons run ahead of you. No, because his first two moves are easy, and I can get a third of his damage done fast. Then he gets a little chaotic. Honestly, I've been thinking about doing it without summons because then I can predict his movements more easily. So I think that's my strat this time. No summons. my fucking turn. Okay, I have to I have to I have to oh that's so annoying. If I get hit, I just can't hit him. Shining, 
Try using your dragon weapon when he hits your summons. Hey, hey, it's a you know what? From a from a from a perspective of someone who hasn't played the game, that might seem like a viable idea, but that move doesn't do as much damage as I think you're led to believe. Uh, and also, this guy does a lot of AoE attacks, so I can't just be right next to him, even if he's attacking my summons and not me personally. Oh, why the fuck didn't you do the jump slash? You need a shield? I need a shield? If you went back in time, you'd give the people on the Titanic a bucket. No brains. What's up here? What is this? Jump slash. It's okay. I learned something new. He has purple balls. I have to dodge roll into the balls. And if I get hit by the balls, they suck me into him. The good news is, is he's just so fucking big and dumb. That sometimes if I'm just in his bussy, he just swings. At like nothing. I'm not even there. That was good, that was good. I just, I missed the timing on the suck-in. Every fucking Elden Ring's boss is the same exact thing. They're the same exact... You want to live in a world where you do, ah, dinch, ah, dinch, ah, ah, ah. And every boss is this. Huh. After 18 seconds. And in the meantime, you're doing this. Is it coming? Is it coming? Is he doing it? Is he doing it? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, shit. And the moment you're done rolling, it's like... 
<laughs> it's every fucking boss. Anyone with even a slight bit of panic, anxiety, or stress in them is just going to falter for hours before they get a boss. Souls games in a nutshell? No. It's actually very, very few bosses in all Souls games that do that. fuck am I meant to dodge that one? Okay, can you... I know two attack patterns you have. Can you do them? Hey, that's a good one. Sucking. Why did I think I could do that? I thought if I didn't get hit by the sword, I wouldn't die. But he just, instead of getting hit by the sword, he just has mystical energy that kills you. I really thought. I was like, damn. This idiot's going to swing in front of him. But then he's just like, nah, my shit also do purple. Do summons? No. I think summons are actually bad. There's two ways to fight this boss. One is just on feet fucking... The other is on horse summoning shit using great bows and magic. And that's going to work for a bunch of... I bet Soda Poppin gets to this boss, does it within 15 tries, and he goes, Oh, that wasn't too bad. Because he is a mage, and he can just run around doing magic shit and summoning shit. And the boss will be dead before he even touches him. Unfortunately, I just have no range, and the summons don't do nearly enough damage, and fighting on the ground with the summons is miserable. They just feed. They feed and they activate his, his fight sequences without me knowing. Your range is stupid. What the? I don't like that one, bro. Magic is lame. Magic is not my preferred style of playing is how I should have phrased it. It's okay if I get hit, I just can't die. Fucking insane. Insane pre shot for me. Which one is it? Okay. One, two, three, four. The foot drag back is brutal. Twice, you fucking ass! Oh, I hate the foot drag one. The foot drag one is just an inevitability that I'll get I'll get hit by it because I keep going for the three peat when I get openings. But maybe I should just hit him once. But then it's gonna take so long. The dodge was good. I know two of his things, right? So so two of his patterns. One is he jumps up and then he slashes down and then he fights around in a circle when he can't when I can't be hit. And that I get like eight hits off. The other one is the four piece. The four piece I get a guaranteed three on, but if he follows up with foot, I'll get hit by foot. 
It's also so hard to heal in this guy. Healing's just a, a bitch. Is this one of the harder bosses? From the lore of the game, he is the strongest of the demigods. Oh, now you whiff? Now your thing is missing wide fucking up? What are you getting worse? Are you, you split the difference? can do three and dodge foot. I don't know that one. That one actually doesn't seem too bad. That one seems not too bad either. This is the, the long wind-up one's fucking annoying because he just gets out of range from his very, very impressive horse. Alright, jump in. Give me the four piece. I got greedy. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just trying. I'm trying to learn so I can attack during purple phase. But maybe I just have to fully ignore purple phase. Maybe purple phase comes up and I just don't fight it. I was hoping to like roll through purple phase, but the lightning thing is annoying. The lightning is a phase change. The lightning is kind. There's no phase change in this boss as far as I'm aware. He just starts doing lightning if he gets a third of his health gone. But he doesn't get another horse stacked up, two horses combined. Jump on the lightning? Seems like an AoE field, but I could try. Try summons once more, you got the hang of it with dodges. The reason I got the hang of it is because the summons activate different fight sequences that I can't control. The hell? that out of reflex.
Oh my god. Can I no longer get away with it? Goddamn time. All right, got him to half though. It's pretty good. For whatever reason, the past two runs, usually I could just sit right under his taint and then just slash him, but I've just been getting hit. But maybe I'm just not moving as well as I used to. I don't know that one at all. I'll keep it a stack. I don't know that one. Use grease to buff your weapon. I'll try that after this run. Is this a one-time thing? How does grease work? Use your own summons? You can't. For whatever reason. Uh, Greece. What's up with Greece? Where the fuck is Greece?
Well, that seems great. Mmm, sacrificial twig is cool. Oh, hello. What this? Eggs, purgatory, and chicken. Heck yeah, thank you. All right, where's Greece at? Oh, interesting. Interesting. So these are all just like magic that you don't need magic for? There's the grease. Is there a damage that's best against this guy? Remembrance, the full moon queen. All right, I think I have a good idea now. Let me try some grease and also maybe this if push comes to shove. So now I think if I do this. Wait, what the fuck? Where's how do I use grease? Oh, that was one spot. I'm being dumb. So grease is this. That's some magic shit. That's some more magic shit. This could be good, too. I'm imagining a world where I get him low, and then I hop on the horse, and I start summoning like a madman. Why not this one? Why not this run, huh? Why not us? Why not now? Let's invest in us. Watch him die after 10 seconds. It is totally possible, if not likely.
All signs point to us losing again. That's what should happen here. So why not change things? Okay, fair enough. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Alright, cool. <laughs> yep, never mind. This is the greatest launch I've ever had in my life. You can take a break if you want to. You can also take a break watching. I'm doing alright. I'm vibing. Fucking stupid. I used two dragon grease. I meant to use the goddamn potion. Grease up now. Chat saying use grease lightning. The problem with grease lightning is that you need to get it on the ladder. that again. It's a waste of grease. Bitches be worried about using an in-game item in a video game while keeping the water running, brushing their teeth. How about you worry about wasting what we need on this earth? Limited resources. I'll use all the grease in a row. Doesn't matter. It'll be fine.
on everything. Fuck. X has beaten Radom, right? How to go from 240 to 325? Uh, 240 was never real. Was that 290 since yesterday? You're actually delivering some misinformation, and I would appreciate if you fact check. Dude, I really thought he wouldn't be able to hit inside his dick, but he can. What am I eating? Eggs purgatory? I think the problem with the summons is that it's just... Yeah, look, I think you guys are, are looking at the game in a very superficial manner, right? Like, I think you just look as a spectator and you're like, Oh, he didn't beat it, therefore that was a waste. The only successful run is when he beats it. But I look at it like, okay, it might take 10, 50, or 100 failed runs to learn what a boss does so that you can beat it. Losing equal learning. And the summons take up such a large part of the time that you're not learning nearly as much because you have to summon them all before you can even get into the fight. Because, like, learning just those two movements that I just took care of, I feel like, is more important than being closer to winning one fight. end of the day I think there's like a little bit of joy that people see in the in the immense, immense amounts of failure either because you've already beaten it and you're like I've done that I am better than you or you just think you could beat it but this boss is like like one one thousandth of the amount of pain and time that it took to beat Pogo Suck 2 and that's all I think in my head so don't care this is actually easy in the grand scheme of gaming this boss is nothing. <laughs> and that's and that's how I get through. Okay, bud. All right, potato, let's make a deal. I have 1 week to beat this. You have 1 week to beat Pogo Suck too. <laughs> Whoever beats it first wins. I will beat this today. You won't beat Pogo Suck 2 for, for weeks. It's 
more Hopian than Copian. You won't? Because you're, you're all being so facetious. The game, if I really want, I can just grind runes, level up, be stronger, and then with the few patterns that I know, because I only know three patterns right now, I'll do double damage, and then it's just GG's. My final take is this game isn't hard. It takes no skill. It's mostly memorization. Not to say there aren't people who are skilled. It's just time in. This is a simple time in game. It's just a fucking MMO, dude. You can be skilled at an MMO, but if you play it enough time, you'll be a high enough level that you can beat anything. It's not like melee. It's not like a competitive game. It's an NPC with like 18 different fight tactics. There's two different jump patterns that look similar, but one's a little lower. This one's higher. No, this one's the low one. So I can only do two hits, and then I have to dash away. Because then he does the sweep. But then there's a high one that I get like 18 hits on. Oh, I hate a whiff. Oh, I thought he was jumping. You can't go under his bosom or his bussy. Try the summons. Dude, the summons is like a crutch. Like, I, 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 the summons can do, I've seen them, a fifth of his HP. So if I feel like I'm there and I'm about to beat him, then maybe I'll whip out the summons. If they're even available at the end. I don't know if there's some weird shit and then they all disappear. Amazing hit, to be honest. I was in the air. Insane hit, to be honest. That's the high one, so now I just hit him like 18 times. Okay. I was a little too far to the right. That was a really unfortunate giant pillar behind me.
Thanks, Grishoff. I've activated one great rune. I don't think I have another one. Because I think Ranella's great rune is just resetting, right? You can buy Smithing Stone free? Don't you mean Somber Smithing Stone 3? I think you're talking about Somber Smithing Stones. I'm almost positive you can't buy Smithing Stone 3. Although, maybe there's an enemy that drops it. XQC didn't beat this boss? No, you're kidding, right? He definitely has. Why horse small? Maybe horse not small, but maybe man big. I hate that move so much. Jump high. Jump high. Chad, I feel like I really eloquently explained my logic for not using summons and for the strategy I'm doing. The phrase, just use summons, is useless to me. You gotta at least give me an argument as to why. And if I don't agree with it, I just won't do it. You know, let's be adult about this.
rule wasn't long enough. Consider summons if I get him to that phase. Another one awaits you. What? 
Damn it! I need a second to heal! amount of people just saying random shit that isn't true in chat. So I'm gonna hit you guys with this one real quick. GG no read. segment is so hard. only. No fucking depth perception on those balls! They all went for me! Thank <laughs> you. 
than doable it's achievable it's expected not wanted dodge roll in three big arrows four summons to start What I realized is I can't let my summons do all the fighting, though. We gotta be there, too. But now I've learned how. Come on. Come at me. We need more, more troops, more people, more help. The kingdom's under attack for fuck's sake, help! I didn't have Meteor on my list. That was fucking crazy. I need summons now more than ever, boys. It had the weekend song on. The only thing scarier than fucking Radon, DMCA. Dude, you did battles this way. I know you are concerned about me, but...
one hit is fucked. start. in there and at some point the king's gotta retire this is called turning 65 no it's not sustainable but let's just let's just make it happen huh I genuinely didn't see it coming. I, I genuinely didn't see it. <laughs> Did you grind the spot XQC found last night? I have to kill this guy to get to that spot. Stop looking at them and dodge. I like the spirit behind your words. What the fuck do you mean? Don't look at them, just dodge. It, it, that, that's literally the meme from Dodgeball. Like, close your eyes and dodge a wrench. I think what I saw from Saldosh...
boosts immunity, robustness, and focus. Maybe. I just, I wish I had enough vigor to live one of those balls. Oh, it's DBZ Piccolo advice. DBZ a bridge, I should say. Just deleted my Facebook feels good. The only reason I can't get rid of Facebook is because Messenger. Not a lot of people, but enough people I only can talk to on there. Sucks to dodge all his moves. And then still not hit him. I maybe should get the long Kuchitana. If it's the same swing speed. I've been throwing poison flasks at him this whole time. Wait, get him. That was the first time I've ever seen him knocked down. Let's get a few more summons, huh? I hate the gold patches with nothing in them. What does that mean? Why is that a thing? Wait, I did summon it. Oh, you can summon over those patches? Did he leave? Is he doing the I'm a fireball thing now? Oh, yeah, he is. He definitely just one-shot someone. <laughs> Insane. Whoever got one-shot there, boys. the same boss up close. <laughs> Give me a summon. Gentlemen, please. A little assistance here. Not the finger maiden. Someone who hits. With a weapon.
I she needed to jump at me once. I think if I didn't get hit by the first move and then he jumped at me, I didn't I, I didn't heal because a uh, pure, unadulterated, unfiltered, disgusting, just copious American levels of greed. Let's fucking do this! I'll get cutie 15 fucking cats before I end my stream. I have one dream. Killing you. On, Radon. Arrows in the sky again. This is old. We did this last time. Washed, repeating content, throwing. And I bet underneath that silly mask, you're also a white man. <laughs> I thought I healed. I thought I healed and I didn't heal. It's okay, just go again. Oh, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it! It's in my bones! Dormammu, I've come to bargain. You must get bored, right? Great shot per usual. Live through it, trumpet. Easy rune, easy clap. I'm rich. My turn. What's up? What are we doing? Jumping in? Love that. Keep that same energy when you have 18 balls of meteor right around you. Fair enough. The double swing is hard to dodge. God, I'm gonna kill so many fucking NPCs so I never have to struggle ever again. I get every shitty one-dimensional anime protagonist so hard right now. They lose one fucking person to their life and all they want to be is just incredibly unsustainably strong so that anything that ever comes in their path they can kill with a single flick so they never have to deal with suffering again. I get it. I'm with you, Sasuke. Or 
or just quit skipping stuff. Hey, Miyazaki made a great game. That exploit of getting 7k runes in 35 seconds is better than playing any normal storyline. It just cuts down probably 90% of the time it would take to get to that. It's alright to admit that. He made a good game. He just left something super fucking easy to uh, exploit in. Fight me! Can't jump over that. Who of you will fight? Show your golden sigil. There you are. Why is it right and right? All right, he's all yours, fellas. Who else? Why does it feel like he's running after me? Why does it- Why is he running after me? Fight with them? <laughs> They're all dead. I need more of them. Alright, let's go. This fourth one is the final one, then we fight. Just kidding, it's a weird light that does nothing. Alright! Can I not get the giant thing on the screen? Why is there a giant thing on my screen? What in the... What in the hell is you doing? Time for more summons? Me squeaks, it is. You raise your resistances? I know. That was what I was trying to do that. It just feels like it's weird that it covers half my screen. Jump at me, please. Yes. No. I'm full health getting one shot by these things. I need like two more vigor levels. If, if I just get hit by them, I'm, I'm donezo. I was on ground, too. I don't... I guess I don't really even know how much more vigor I need.
your friends. Romans, countrymen. I got one pot and one wolf guy. Where's everybody at? I got one pot now. Okay, I got fucking no one. Where are you? Oh, the maiden. The problem is, maiden, it's not you, it's me. If I'm full health, I still die. So I kind of need, like, you know... Like, if you could overheal, maybe. If you were, like, Reyna. Where the hell are all the summons? Am I smoking Reaper? There they are. Dude, I feel like I just have to literally run around in circles until they spawn. That's so fucking lame. I spent 30 minutes running around trying to find the goddamn gold things that spawn. Sheesh! Sheesh! Shit, I missed the fucking cutscene activation. Really good fucking first round, baby. Really good fucking first round, boys. Keep that energy, baby. Let's go! I could use some summons right about now. Seeing a lot of death screens, not a lot of summon screens. Oh, there they are! Oh, 
Okay, I think what I fucked up is I summoned too many at the start. I think there's about five summons, six summons, maybe, that you can do at max. And if the summons are dead, they take about, like, ten seconds, or fifteen, maybe, for their sigil to respawn. And so when I'm spawning everybody at the start, I'm fucking myself. And I should really just summon these first three, maybe four, and then call it a day. And then I have a guaranteed summon that has a fresher body. Because if everybody's dead, then he just chases me at the end and he's OP as shit. Fuck me. Can, you, can, I, can, I, can I come fight you? Do you like doing the arrow thing? What a phenomenal round. Happy gate. The problem with people who aren't subscribed to the channel is they're not avid viewers, as members are on average. So usually people who come on, uh, uh, come on. I just read someone's advice that said, "Hey, try beating it without summons." For an hour, I tried beating it without summons, and I got like bullied by people saying, "Use summons." There's like no winning. It's, the problem is there's too many individuals in this world who are all operating on different levels of information, all with some absurdly high confidence that their advice is worthwhile. They off nothing! Except that maybe they beat Dark Souls 2 once. You know how it starts, baby. One jump at a time. Let's go. Another jump? No. One, two, three, four. What's up? Some fresh bodies. Where'd he go? Damn, that song was sick. I wish I could listen to it again. You're moving too fast on that fucking roller skate of a horse. There's no way to dive through that one. Attack! All forces! That was bad. God, his purple form is just a pain in the ass. Sometimes you can just hit him so hard he doesn't get the purple. Are you close? I think I'm where XQC was at yesterday, and I think XQC could beat the game today. That's my honest assumption. Because XQC is very close to beating the game. And if I do basically everything he did, I could beat it. But that's if he beats it today. If I go see XQC stream and he's like not even close, then I'm fucked.
Give two attacks I like, do one of them. This is not one of them. That's so fucking annoying! There's no way out of that one! You covered the only place I could roll! Oh. Inspirational. Thank you very much, Fletch, for becoming a member. That move. One hit for that. It's fucking annoying when the other guys are involved, dude. He does so many other spinny, dancey, cringy moves when the other guys are involved. But then sometimes we just lock on and all gears are synced and we're godlike. But then other times they're just basically making him better. I'm not gonna say the summons for the end because the summons still have a lot of damage stacked up at some points. Please upgrade. I I've seen that comment a lot. It's really short sighted because it implies that there's an upgrade to be done. If you mean please grind for mats and then upgrade, that's a different question. But grinding for mats also isn't that easy at this point either. It's about like 20,000 to get one fucking level. You're saying like upgrade. Like I, I hit the upgrade button and then it's like, oh shit, I'm stronger now. You mean grind mats for a few hours and then return. Unless you don't mean that and you just don't know what's going on. Either way, use your words better. Kind of bad for me, honestly. Yeah, the stones get buried if you summon too many people.
Dude, the animations in this game are so shit. They do less damage than not the animations. Fuck, I didn't see it, dude. It's such a it's such a weird mechanic because if someone's knocked down, you can hit them in the gold point and then it does an animated attack. But the animated attack does far less than just slashing at their body because the amount of time that they stay down is longer, and then also the time they take to get up, you can attack them. It's so weird. Like ideally, you should have the animate like the cool thing be the strong thing, but it's never ever the case. It's only for cool, maybe, like, finishes, if you know they're at low enough health. Anyway, that's a ramble. That has nothing to do with the fight. I'm gonna avoid his face from that one. The balls do something weird. They slowly fade to the side, then they go forward. So the moment they end fading to the side slowly, you just have to do it. It's not like even a thing you should react to. And I just kind of figured that out. Also, we didn't do enough damage for him to be in that final phase, to be honest. We can do a lot more. He went at the earliest possible time, which was unlucky.
I'm alone with the savage beast running after me. And a fucking maiden. God, the maiden is useless. I gotta find where her spawn is and avoid it. No offense to her. She's maybe she's keeping the other units alive, but I, All right, if I win this one, then Nintendo has to add Melee at Evo. It's not a debate. It is a rule. I'm assuming this is the last boss. Great call, King. Great call. Okay, all three of these are good to summon. You stop doing the fucking slidey thing every five seconds, bro. One, two, three, four. Fucking amazing job, fellas. Now let's get summoned and kill this motherfucker so we're done for the day. What's that bright light?
damn it, that was the finger maiden. Jump at me. That was not really what I was thinking was gonna happen there. I thought he was jumping! Oh. I thought he was jumping, dude. He was doing some cringy ass summoning of the balls. The animations are so similar. They reused them. Miyazaki, you're so lazy. You reused animations. All right, it's right. We're fine. What's up, baby? Nice. Good shot. Come on. Come on. Okay, that's not what I thought you were going to do. That jumping slash was bold. Alright, we could use a couple more. Finger Maiden. Oh, that's fine. Couple more. Who's here? Okay, Jesus. Jesus. Just to be clear, you guys are still in the fucking game with me, right? What's going on? Damn it, he just targeted me so hard. There's like a certain point where you have to just keep hitting him because then he gets staggered and then knocked down. And that's when you deliver like 80% of his health. And then the final 10, I think I can just squeeze out one time if I get lucky. How many deaths am I at? I have not kept track. Dr. Do thank you the membership. Elden Ring released in 2022, heralding it as one of the most difficult video games that was ever created. Miyazaki invented a world along with George R.R. Martin that will be remembered for generations. Not just for its expansive storyline and large-scale open-world map, but also its innovative and very difficult bosses. One boss exemplified this the most, Radon. He's the most powerful demigod. The game even gives you summons, just to make it a little easier. And one speedrunner became the first to ever defeat him. This is the story of love. Let's fucking go! Oh shit. Okay, fair enough.
mods. I want Euphus's head on a platter. Ten minutes, please, for that motherfucker. Euphus, you wait for me every time to die, and then you say, Upgrade by Stones. Which means you've copied and pasted the message, but you never once, in the pacing, thought, Maybe I should correct what I'm saying, because I keep writing Stones. I didn't even summon you! This is bad. He's too high health for the second phase. I got one fucking pot and a maiden. Alright, you four. The world's counting on us. Do the jumpy thing. Seems like a good time to summon. Oh, please. This is not the time to dick me on summons.
Honestly, we... Like, the fucked part is we did so much damage on the final phase. If we had had a good first phase and brought him down to that amount of HP, we would have won. But he started the, the last phase with so much HP. He's just such a fucking loony, though. He's just such a... He's a wild card, really. He's out of pocket. I didn't want to say it. I think he should get cancelled. I feel like his actions are just deplorable. Jump, you bitch. Thank you. Now do it again. Finger Maiden! That wasn't too bad. Not the best, not the worst. I was a little too far away to apply appropriate enough damage for that situation, but we still have a decent job. Chance. Whatever. Stop driving around in your fucking weird horse car. Nothing you could do there! That was literally unwinnable! Oh, what?! Three one-hit death balls coming at me. I dodge all of them. And then he does the only move that if I dodge, it still kills because it just has such a persisting hitbox. At me!
time. I, I didn't want to have to do it, bro. I, I didn't want to. I thought, let's save the anime music for the final boss. Let's be reasonable, okay? We're reasonable people. He's left me no choice. Right. A good quality of life thing would be my re uh, my runes not showing up if I have zero. Only specifically for this fight where I can't fucking tell what's a rune or a summon. Nice combo, you douche. Shit. Jake, either way, none of it will revolve around your concert, but I hope you have a good time. And I can't tell you, man. You're asking dumb questions. I hope you understand that. But I hope you have a great time at the concert. Really. Oh, 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 oh,
Thank you, Yo. I just want to go back in. I got 2016 loading screens, a 40 foot walk, a teleport, 2016 loading screens, and then a 45 second walk. That was good. He had to go through phase two before going to phase three, so we got off to some extra chip damage. Oh my god, my summon's going off. 
Come on, give me some more summons, please. Just let me win off summons, baby. No, not the fucking maiden. Anyone but the fucking maiden. Literally anyone. I fucking summoned the maiden! Maiden, go with them. Okay, I summoned everybody. Now here's my plan. Fucking run. You guys got it. You guys got it. He's so close. He's so close. I did the start, you do the end. You know what I mean? Yes! Yes! Group project! Group project! Come on! Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We're so fucking close. We're so fucking close. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more! Guys, please. Please! Someone be my hero! Cause I can't be it! Yes! One more hit! One more hit, come on! I guess it fucking has to be me. Yeah! Yeah! Let's go! Let's go! Yeah! Fuck yeah! Okay, plastic love after he dies. That song did line up perfectly. Oh my god. Oh, shit. The summons did great at the end too. But they he they brought him down to like one percent and he did the exact move I needed him to. That was like that was like cinematic. Me watching from afar with my maiden, everybody fucking dies. I get one strong slash to end it. Oh, I don't, I don't, I forget his name. His name's like, like the Garlith. Whoever the Garlith is was the MVP. When I summoned him, he did so much damage and he lived so long. He was like, a, he was like a summoner. Oh, dude, that's so fucking dope. We just beat him and we never have to do it again. Oh my god, and I can't believe I did it as impressively and as quickly as Saldosh. We're the same. <laughs> Final blow. It's actually like I'm the captain of the ship, and then I let all my lackeys do the work, and then the final blow, I just walk in, and I do one slash, and then I leave. <laughs> Is shared by Radan and you. And <laughs> did you see that afterwards? A falling star right before our eyes. Yes! I can't fathom how Radan was holding back something at that scale. 
He was a living legend if ever I saw one. And the path has now been cleared. To Nokla, where Rani's fate will be decided. Let's meet where the falling star bit the earth. We'll take up our souls once more for Mistress Rani. Yeah! Okay, the falling star is what unlocks the area where the XQC exploit lives. Oh, fuck. Seventy K. Okay. Yeah, dude. Fuck yeah. That's so sick. I love winning. It doesn't happen that often, but boy, when it happens, is it fucking dope. I think I need a lot more vigor. Is what I've noticed. I felt like my health was way too low, and I get getting one shot is the worst feeling on earth. Certain moves, I get it. Right. You should get one shot. But some shit, like, you shouldn't get one shot by. I got one shot by the arrows. That's fucked up. So I think I want to go more vigor. For now. I'll probably reinvent my attacks anyway, so I'm not too worried about it. Oh, dude, my, I, uh, I'd say my heart's still racing, but you guys can see. Oh my god, I'm getting, I'm getting shivers. You need intelligence and faith for spells? Yeah, we're grinding for that right now. So my dream is to be, one, done with this game by tomorrow, midnight, Hawaiian time. Two, to uh, be a dragon samurai. And I have a dragon um, item. And I have some dragon spells. But I don't have the arcane and all that good shit to learn them. So I'm going to do that right now. My first objective is getting to <sighs> Norrock, Knockrock. Nokron. I need to go to Nokron. That's the whole point. That's what the star falling just opened up. So I need to go to Mistwood, which is this. <clears throat> and it should be somewhere here. Maiden was the MVP. Dude, honestly, the Maiden wouldn't be bad if she healed the summons. But healing me is useless because I have 10 flasks and I also get one shot. So you can't heal me. The moment I get hit, I die. If she healed the summons, who are absolutely tanky as fuck, she would have been goaded. Because then my summons would have just been living around. Sorry, let me yeah, let me look at some of the donos. <sighs> okay, I don't want to die to a pig right now. No offense, man. If I beat Radon and then lose to you, it's a bad look for both of us. What if she healed both? Sure. I'm not that greedy. I'm just saying do do one. Uh, okay, five bucks said that's my streamer five bucks. Let's go I guarantee patches wouldn't have been a uh, summon I would have been a summon had Ludwig not murdered him if patches was a summon I wouldn't use him. He would have gotten fucking rocked. He lost to me. I'm terrible uh, I work at subway once had a lady yell at me because I put sauce on top of the veggies not under it But she did not tell me to do that Why the f what the fuck is the difference? They're the same thing. I swear to God, working at Subway should get you, like, you know, five years of therapy free as, like, a severance package. Because everybody's a psychopath. There's so many just weird psychopathic people. And you have to talk to them.
Oh, two. Give me a smithing stone three, dude. Smithing stone twos fall off the big hands. They're easy to farm. Oh, it's here. I think I see the site of the crash. Has he finished a final boss? <sighs> With nothing but remorse, I have to say no. And follow up with, I don't think I'm... I think I'm genuinely 50% through the game. I have never made that claim before. I think I'm going to claim that now. I think I'm halfway through. And it took me two and a half days to do it. And I have one and a half day to beat the rest of the game. Admittedly, I didn't use the first two and a half days very well. And I was also worse at the game. That was a main boss. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, golden seed. Gentlemen, I appreciate your offerings. The game gets harder. <laughs> Somebody's not a juicer. Okay, let me tell you that much. XQCLs in chat for the easiest second half of a game ever. Here's the thing about my juicer. He's a gaming warlord. Oh, welcome, dear customer. I've never That's once found a, a valuable item in their shops. What the heck? Okay, so supposedly the Fallen Star knocks some things over, unlocking new parts of the map. Oh. I think I found it. Am I supposed to fucking jump down the rocks? No way, right? Like some Kingdom Hearts shit? World that never was? I swear to God, this game was just inspired by Kingdom Hearts. You should use all your runes before you lose them. Oh, let me do this actually. Nothing will ever be as bad as XQC losing 450,000 runes yesterday. One of the funniest fucking things I've ever seen. I've never seen a man look more nervous and choke harder in my life. He lost 450k, yeah. He found this amazing rune um, farm area. And he grinded it for like 45 minutes. Like an hour. Just a long time. Like, very repetitive, like, da 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 And then, there's, like, basically an enemy that you can kill that gives you a lot of XP. There are three of them, but the third one's kind of hard to get. And halfway through, he's like, you know what? I'm, I'm going to min-max it even further. 
I've already exploited the game to such a degree that I get 500,000 runes an hour. I'm going to exploit it even further. And he went for another fucking... Uh, another guy. Which requires you to just make a somewhat tricky jump with the horse. So he just chokes it. Dies. Which is fine, because if you die, you can go back to where you died and get your runes. Fuck! Fuck! Uh, I mean, at this point, fuck it, dude. I'm, I'm done with it. Oh, was that him going back for it? Oh, that was him going back for it already. Yeah, he just choked the double jump. <laughs> I, don't, I, I didn't keep watching. How many did he grind after that? Oh, you know what, actually? I can take this shit off. Member only. Oh, no. Dude, 95% of non-members are totally chill, cool people, half of which never even care to type. But it also includes a lot of people who just come in for one minute and say some shit. And that's the biggest problem, are the people who just come in and say some shit. They just got some shit to say. Still live? Still here? I'm gonna leave for four hours. I, I came back. Damn, this is crazy. I met a girl, had a kid, came back, you're still here. And it, it, it's never original. Have you tried doing X, Y, Z? And, I, and I've read all of them and responded to all of them, but they, they're just showing up, so they don't know. And they don't give a shit about my answer. They just want to, you know, throw in their two cents. So when I'm molding at a boss, it gets mad at him. Miss an opportunity for Coconut Mall, that boss. See what I mean? See what see what I mean about these guys? <laughs> just a just a touch of them, a t a few of them. Oh, he's got some shit to. S I had the best song at the end that ended perfectly with the final hit. Beautiful cutscene as the as the stars cascaded downwards. They're like, mm, should have done Coconut Mall though. Long time viewer, first time chatter. Should have done Coconut Mall there, buddy. Anyway, keep up the good work. Alright, when we get to the new area, chat, remind me. I have to refill my water. A not optional water refill is necessary because yesterday I did not drink nearly enough water and it fucked me. That'd be backseating. <laughs> See what I mean about these guys? They don't quit. They don't quit. They always got they always got a little two cents. A little, a little snide comment. I don't believe in therapy. That's just backseating IRL. <laughs> it's actually obviously a meme. Generally, a good therapist never tells you what to do. Dude, my hairline's money as fuck. I don't even need to show you, dude. I'm working with nothing but gas. Oh. A 
a nascent butterfly. Nascent. Oh. Surely got to be one of those little fires around here. Smithing stone five, pog champ. But if a smithing stone three could come up, that'd be great too. <gasps> Jesus. Oh, yay. Genuinely, that was harder than the boss. Refill water. Let me get my stones. Let me get my stones. Sit. And then let me pull up someone else who's playing. Let's do our daily check-in on other people playing Elden Ring. It's one of my favorite segments of the day. We do it a few times a day just to see uh, what everyone's up to. Not a lot of people online right now, it feels like. Damn, McConnell's playing. He's streaming? What the hell? Jerma? Yeah, it feels like a less... Oh, Charlie's live. Oh, he just went live. Big A's live. Here. Competitive multiplayer. What? I never knew that existed. Oh, you can like duel someone? Oh, that's actually be fun. I would love to duel Atriok. Wait. We should do bros versus pros. Isn't most of dueling just having a good character? I feel like 3v1. Maybe I'm maybe this is off base. If we all had the same accounts, no pro would ever kill all three of us. Never. We could do 1v1v1. We could try. You know what? That's why it's a good bros versus pros. We could try 3v1. And if it doesn't work, you do 1v1v1v1. Like back to back to back to back. And the guy can't heal at all. Okay. He's probably 3,000. 4,000. Hell yeah. All right. So that... I might have enough to do it twice. I'm going to leave Germa on for a bit while I get some water. Oh, not really. Oh, this is... I, I'm going to be so far behind. I'm going to be... Mine... What else does mine do? What does mine do? It determines FP and affects focus. What does focus do? The resistance to sleep and bouts of madness. So if I... Uh, there's going to be one boss in this game that's a sleep boss and it's going to be the one that I can actually handle. I don't know. I feel like I kind of need to level up this after I beat a boss and get like 30,000, 40,000 souls. Imagine the amount of damage I'm not going to be doing to, en to bosses and enemies though because I want to have 20 mind. I think it has to be dex. Or, or intelligence. At some point, as the game starts to snowball in its difficulty, I can't be like 20 in every stat, Andy. Do intelligence. I 
actually might. Let me just go over here. Oh, there's like a wolf uh, down over here. Don't howl, just come at me and attack me. You got a lot of health. I don't want to fight any of you. I just want to come over and see if there's any jewels behind that rock. We back. But what's the, what's the I'm, I'm, we're going to figure out what it is and I'm going to know what it is in like a minute. I don't want to fight you. Okay. They were guarding something over here. What was it? How come they didn't attack in the pack? I don't know. There's a bunch. All right. I don't want to. I just want to get through. I don't want to go kill the all these wolves for no reason. Anything over here? This is another area. Holy shit. Okay, this is... This is, game is way bigger than I thought it was. I thought it was like this here. This game is huge. It's huge. All right, we gotta go back. It comes weeks of Elden Ring. <laughs> um, I don't know how I'm gonna handle this. I wonder. Uh, because the game is so massive and there's so much going on. I don't think I have to play through the entire game in the first six or seven days it comes out. Sorry about that, boys. If this truly is a hundred plus hour experience... I think this I, could easily be a hundred plus hour experience. If you are playing to have fun, this is a hundred hour experience game. Alright, what's this? Although, I've always been the type of guy, I don't know if you guys are like this, I've always been like, I've never been a 100% guy. In RPGs, when I beat the final boss, I give up on the game completely. It has like no replay factor for me. So I have to do all the side missions and all that good shit before going to the boss. Otherwise, I'll just never touch it again. I don't know why, it's not like a good trait. What's this? All right, Big A is actually in the same area we are, but probably before. It looks like he's in the in the misting whatever area, I think. Do I need to get off your horse to touch grass? Oh, All right. New. Did a truck fight the bear in this area? 2K Dono. It's 2K. It's 2K yes, Knock. Kevin. What the hell is 2K Knock? You're brilliant. Involve your audience. Osmond Grov. 2K Knock. What's a knock? Norway, Norwegian, Kroner. It's four hundred dollars. It's two hundred twenty dollars. It's two hundred twenty dollars. I can't believe I got that right. By the way, a no, uh, it's a Norwegian Kroner. That's great. It seems to have like the same exchange rate. Eh, probably a little lower. It's like the same exchange rate. It's closer. I guess it's pretty similar to, to Kroners, right? Swedish Kroners. 
despite the collapse of the Golden Order. Can someone, in a small but sufficient way, tell me why the Nordic countries don't just use euros and instead choose to use their own individual kroner? Because why not? I assume it makes the euro stronger and trade easier. Norway's not in the EU? What? Really? None of them. Sweden or Norway are not in the EU? Sweden is. Okay. I I was going to say I definitely think Sweden's in the EU, but I didn't want to say it for sure. But Norway's not. Is it because they have some resource they don't want to give up or something? Do they just have a shit ton of oil or something? And this makes trade better for them? I read something cool that Norway sells all their oil and the oil sales automatically go into a fund for every citizen. So there's some reserve of money for every citizen based off the trillions they're making in oil sales. That amounts to like a, it's like a pretty, re, like a large sum of money. Oh, my death strong. Are my death strong? It's three, five, three, six. I don't know what it is. It's more up. I thought it was on like the cliff side. I went full. Whoa. Dude, what? I went fully up the cliff side and didn't get to it. Oh, this guy. Red Wolf of Radigan is hard. You definitely need to summon for it. I mean, you don't have to. It could be good. It's supposed to be at 361. I believe any number chat says. Not really. Important. Okay. Well, you have 344 messages here. Hyping apparently is important to you. Okay. I'll stick with 366 for now, I guess. Unless someone who's knowledgeable proves me otherwise. Or tells me otherwise. Uh, can I level? Probably not. Why are you not on Twitch? Uh, there's a really good video about it on Mogul Mail, bud. Where I give my uninterrupted thoughts over the period of 10 minutes. Whatever I could say in the 15 seconds of your attention that you're willing to give me will not suffice. So if you really care, I would check it out. 